Liam cheated on Miley with 14 different women, one of them allegedly being January Jones. Sources said that he would send texts to her saying, I want to do this, this, and that to you. And he was still engaged to Miley while he was doing this. It's not even like they were kind of on a break. Miley Cyrus's recent song has been the talk of time because she has allegedly exposed Liam Hemsworth for cheating on her with 14 other women while the two were still married. And not only did Miley wear the gold outfit, she filmed in the house that he cheated on her with with another girl and she released the song on his birthday it's a savagery for me like 14 girls seriously so miley cyrus released flowers a breakup track and music video on january 13th 2023 and coincidentally or not it was also her ex-husband liam hemsworth's birthday the public speculated that the song was a message to her ex or to the public about him this created a buzz about the song even before its release when it was eventually released miley cyrus flowers turned the heads of millions it became one of the most popular songs of 2023 and the year just started. Right after the song dropped, many conspiracies started popping up about the ex-couple's relationship, but the one that took the internet by storm was that Liam Hemsworth cheated on Miley Cyrus. This information started from pop culture observer Pop Tings who wrote a tweet on January the 13th saying, The house where the music video for Miley Cyrus Flowers was recorded was previously used by Liam Hemsworth to cheat on Miley with more than 14 women while they were married. This tweet sparked a heated conversation on social media with most supporting the claim. While this story has since taken a life of its own, TikTokers have began combing the Flowers video for additional incriminating news. Another persistent, but also unverified claim that has been said is that Hemsworth dedicated Bruno Mars's When I Was Your Man to Cyrus at their wedding and that the lyrics of Flowers are a nod to Mars's lyrics. Others speculated that the gold evening dress Cyrus wears in the video is a reference to the gold dress Jennifer Lawrence wore to the Hunger Games premiere, and thus hinting that Hemsworth hooked up with his former co-star. This wouldn't be much of a shocker since Jennifer offhand admitted something along those lines. In an interview with Andy Cohen on Watch What Happens Live with Andy Cohen, she was asked whether she kissed Hemsworth when the cameras weren't rolling and she responded that she and Hemsworth grew up together. She said, Liam's real hot. What would you have done? Before finally admitting, yeah, I have. Other wardrobe claims include that in the video Cyrus was wearing the same suit that Hemsworth wore at the Avengers and game premiere where he reportedly told her to behave while she was posing on the red carpet. There is a video of Miley and Hemsworth at the event where while they were posing Hemsworth seems to have told her to behave before she pushed him away and started posing by herself. The video was a speculation of what seemed to have happened but only the two of them know what was actually said. Yet another creator on TikTok claims that Cyrus does Hemsworth's workout routine in the video. Though, again, there's nothing on the record that can be traced back to. She even claimed that Miley also did the twerk dance that her ex-husband got mad at her doing on the red carpet. The point is, this gossip snowball has turned into an avalanche in which it's hard to separate back from fiction. While some social media users were busy digging up conspiracies about the song. In turn, other social media users have pointed out that Miley Cyrus never meant all the rumors that have sparked up because she herself once said that infidelity wasn't why she and Hemsworth divorced. In August 2019, she tweeted, The truth is, once Liam and I reconciled, I meant it, and I was committed. There are no secrets to uncover here. I've learned from every experience in my life. I'm not perfect. I don't want to be. It's boring. I'd grown up in front of you, but the bottom line is, I have grown up. She the went on to say that she could admit to a lot of things, but she refused to lie and admit that her marriage ended because of cheating. Liam and I have been together for a decade. I've said it before and it remains true, I love Liam and always will," she continued, but at this point, I had to make a healthy decision for myself to leave a previous life behind. I am the healthiest and happiest I have been in a long time. You can say I am a twerking, pot-smoking, foul-mouthed hillbilly but I am not a liar. These fans' theories base over the fact that Miley and were once a magical couple before Tay separated. The couple got married in 2018 and announced their split less than a year later in 2019. They definitely had their ups and downs, including the disastrous experience in late 2018 when California wildfires wiped out their home in Malibu. Fans have pointed out the fact that Miley references the disaster in the first verse we were right till we weren't, built a home and watched it bury. Cyrus told Howard Stern that she and her ex-husband had lost everything. In the interview with Rolling Stone in 2020, she revealed that the fire did what she couldn't do herself. It removed me from what no longer was serving its purpose, she told the magazine. And then as you drown, you reach for that lifesaver and you want to save yourself. I think that's really what, ultimately, getting married was for me. One last attempt to save myself. Cyrus and Hemsworth were in an on and off relationship since 2009 after they met on the set of the last song. In the interview with Howard Stern, Cyrus also revealed that she didn't think her and Hemsworth would ever tie the knot. We were together since we were 16, she said.
To her, it was just a part of growing up and separating with someone who was with her as she grew up. Miley continued that the Malibu incident was a breakthrough for her, however painful. Our house burned down. We had been like, engaged. I don't know if we really ever thought we were actually going to get married. But when we lost our house in Malibu, which if you listen to my voice pre and post fire, they're very different so that trauma really affected my voice. She was in South Africa when it happened so she couldn't go home. She lost everything to the point where she had to tie her animals to a post at the beach. Factors like this are what's making fans come up with crazy theories about the song thus creating a good buzz around the single. Miley might have or not anticipated the song would get a lot of attention but the rumors have become all the publicity that the song needed. Miley Cyrus' sister, Brandy Cyrus also talked about the song and the rumors surrounding it on the Your Favorite Thing podcast. Miley's new song, All the Tea, and all the narratives that fans are making on TikTok. It's so good, the song did come out on his birthday, was that on purpose? I don't know, can't say, genius, though. She claimed that song was entertainingly shady from its release to the video and its contents. To her, it was more entertaining to see the buzz around it because now social media is positively awash with the claim that Hemsworth cheated on Cyrus with 14 separate women in the very house where the video was filmed. Like, every day I wake up to a new one. The first one was something about this Bruno Mars song. They're like, Liam played the Bruno Mars song at their wedding. And this is a response to the Bruno Mars song. That one's funny, she said. She said it was the best PR that could ever happen because it gets people to talk about the song on Twitter and other social media platforms. The narratives are fucking hilarious, but it's so great. And it's just so fun to watch it all play out. Miley fans, I love ya. Miley used the chorus of Mars' song as an interpolation for the chorus for Flowers, but again, there aren't any verifications as to whether the claim is true. As for if the rumors are true, Randy told the podcast, I'm not here to say that's true and what's not true. Only Miley knows the truth. A fan on Twitter said, Miley Cyrus's close friends report that Liam Hemsworth called her about the rumors that have been circulating regarding her song Flowers. You destroyed our marriage and now you'll destroy my reputation, he said. When Miley Cyrus reminded him of his cheating, he hung up. Another said, if we're gonna meme and mock the cop for cheating on her husband, we need to drag Liam Hemsworth for what he did to Miley. It's just as bad if not worse. Anyways, let's not forget that this video is based on theories and my opinions and should not be considered facts. That's it for this video. Bye.